Good morning girls and boys, welcome to day 8 of it, drilling as much as Europe as we can in 30 days. We've just finished our first week and we've been to Spain, France, Luxembourg, Germany, Switzerland, Italy and we are currently in Slovenia. We did want to leave the country this morning but the train that we wanted to take isn't running until this afternoon. So we're changing up a bit today, we're going to head to the train station and we're just going to get on the next train and see where we end up. Yeah, I think we definitely needed that sleep after a few crazy days. We have both been exhausted so feeling refreshed now. It's really warm here in Slovenia. They've got this water misted thing to cool people down. We just had a look at the departure board. There's a train leaving in about 12 minutes to Ljubljana, which is the train behind us now. We're not going to head all the way to Ljubljana because we've already been there yesterday. So I think it's time for a game plan. Step one, we're going to jump on this train. We're going to head towards Ljubljana and we're going to pick a stop at random and just jump off and see what's there. Step number two, we're going to explore that stop for a few hours and see what we can find that's good to do there. Step number three, we're going to try and get out of Slovenia tonight and jump on a train to a brand new country. Have a look at where the train to Ljubljana stops and there's three stops between here and Ljubljana so I think we're just going to go for the middle one a place called Selje Selje we'll see what's there we made it to Selje this looks like a right little cute place this does as soon as we come out of the train station this is the view that we see big building there this building looks really cool, and the centre is this way. So this way we go. Good luck on Google, and there seems to be two cool things to do here: a castle and a science museum. So we're gonna flip a coin, and we're gonna let the coin decide. We're gonna go the heads, castle, tail, science museum. Oh, castle it is! Let's go! It's on a hill. Ed Sheeran. Over the castle on the hill. We put in some sun cream on because we don't want to burn again. It is hot in Slovenia. Look how lovely Slovenia is. And that's the castle we're going to up there. I wasn't expecting a hike, I don't know why, because the castle is on a hill. But the hike has begun. Well, that hike ended up being really steep. Look how much I'm sweating. Can you see? Yep. And look at the state of my face. I'm hoping there's a good view out to this window behind me. Look at that view. It's not the view I wanted to see. I wanted to see the town over that way, but it's still pretty good. It's so pretty. We didn't realise Slovenia was this nice. I know. I didn't really have many expectations of Slovenia, but it's really exceeded the expectations that I didn't have. This is so cool, I feel like I'm in the set to Game of Thrones in Winterfell. Whoa. Okay, that's sick. Look at this. That walk up is definitely worth it. This is insane. For that view. The views, the views just keep getting better and better. We realise we haven't spoken about the £100 budget that we're trying to stick to in the past few videos. Um, we are still well on track, we're doing really well. Today so far we spent £12 on the castle, no, €12 Euro on the castle, so probably about £10 something. But we will keep you updated of the budget throughout the videos too. We're back in the train station now, we've got about 15 minutes to wait till our next train, and now we move on to the next country. But we've got a connecting stop. I'm feeling a little bit tired, especially after that big walk, that hike. But feeling good, feeling excited for the next place. So we've got one stop in between here and our next destination for a changeover and that's only seven minutes. And the train is meant to, was meant to be here 
One minute ago. One minute ago. It's going to be really tight even if the train comes now and we don't want to end up in this train station that we're going to change over in because it is in the middle of nowhere. So it's 20 past three now. The train should have come at 12 minutes past. So there's an eight minute window and we only had a seven minute changeover. So the train's too late. We're going to miss our connections. We're not going to bother. I don't know what we're going to do. I'm so annoyed. Okay, I think the plan is we're going to get on this train to Zazani Most and then we're going to decide where we go in when we get there. As you can tell, we missed the train. Through no fault of our own, thankfully. The solace here is a quarry and a train station. There's, there's a, a pub. There's a pub in the train station. It's cash only, we only had five euros cash. So we managed to get a beer each. We don't even have enough for another one. Nope, so we're gonna have to make these last. It is a really pretty place though. It is, we're yeah. surrounded by the mountains. It's not all that bad. Yes, yeah, so we're stuck here for another what, two and a half hours. Yeah. Three and a half hours. Oh my God, you're joking. Three and a half hours we're stuck here for, and that's all we've got is a packet of crisps, a beer, and two bottles of flavored water. I've started out whether this train is even gonna come. It is 7.35 now, and the train should have been here at 7.29. I don't know if you can hear me because it's so windy, but the train's really, really busy and we have to stand up in this corridor because all the people take up. Welcome to Zagreb, everyone. A lot later than expected. It is busy here. I know it's late, I know it's dark, but I think it's time for a game plan. Step number one, we're going to rush to a shop because the shop closes in 10 minutes and we need to get some food. Step number two, we're going to head to the apartment and check in. Step number three, we're going to cook some food because we're starving. We're going to have a shower because we're sweaty. We're going to figure out a new plan for tomorrow because the day Lit. went dreadfully. <laughs> Today's plans are not for the plans. We need new plans tomorrow. Okay, this is nice. This is really nice. This apartment is really nice. It costs us about £53, which brings our daily total up to £74.92. Yes, we are in budget again today. In fairness, we ended up sitting at that train station for about three hours, but I'm going to give you a quick room tour, house tour, apartment tour. First of all, we've got the kitchen, oven, hob, sink, dishwasher, everything you need there, fridge, kitchen bar, wardrobe, double bed, private blanket, and finally a bathroom. Shame that we had to rush to a shop with very limited options. We haven't got the best meal tonight. We could have had something better, but we've got food. I'm not gonna lie, when we got in here, we put the camera down, we ended up cooking and having a shower, and it's only been about an hour, but it's 12 o'clock already, and we've got an alarm set for six. Thanks for watching day eight. We'll see you in day nine. Good night. Do, 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 do.